Yeah, it was tough. Um, I mean, like I said yesterday, it was, it was pretty tough waking up, and uh, it, we just bounced back. We had a really good practice yesterday, which I think was huge, and uh, we realized uh, we, we had a chance at a bronze medal, which is a great honor, so we, we made sure we bounced back. Uh, awesome. Uh, it's a great feeling. Um, you know, it's not gold, but we'll take it. Uh, anytime you get a medal at a tournament of this caliber, um, it's special. It's something I'll remember for the rest of my life. Uh, we're still playing for a bronze medal, so any type of medal, I think, uh, everyone has a little pride to just earn that. And, uh, kind of go with the bang and keep our heads held up. It was huge. You know, USA Hockey's never medaled twice in a row at the World Junior Tournament. And to, uh, to do it and earn a bronze medal against such a great Sweden team, um, you know, for me personally, um, you know, I wanted that gold medal. That's, that's what I had my heart set on. So it's not quite the same, but to be a, a team like Sweden, um, there's a lot of positives and positives that come out of it. Um, personally, you know, it's it's uh, it's a huge honor. Um, it's a huge honor to be selected to this team and to win back-to-back -back medals. It's, it's a huge honor. Um, and for the organization, hopefully, you know, and USA Hockey's obviously had some great showings recently. Hopefully, they can keep on going, keep on progressing. Well, I mean, I think it's a couple of firsts. I guess they. I wasn't aware of this, but uh, I knew it was the first time that we won back-to-back -back medals, and I think it's also the first time that we've won a medal at home. Um, but I, I think it's it's a sign of uh, of the depth and breadth of the, the quality of players that uh, USA Hockey is producing. That, you know, we can be a competitor in this tournament on a year-to-year -year basis.